What are generally the closing costs incurred when purchasing property? This is a huge question that most people don't notify their clients of ahead of time. And I get a ton of questions about what fees are involved, what fees do I control, what is my legal fee in all of this, and what could they change as a purchaser? This answer comes in three parts. Generally, your closing costs include lender's closing costs, a title bill, and out-of-pocket fees. The first portion of these closing costs are your lender's costs. These are the amounts that are gonna come out of your original loan amount. It's really important for a purchaser to understand that at the closing, they won't actually receive the $465,000 loan that they applied for. In fact, the lender takes out all of their closing costs from that loan amount, deduct it, and give you a net amount that they bring to the closing. So if you do actually need additional money for your closing, it's important to understand that you might have to apply for a higher loan amount than just the balance of the purchase price. The next portion of your closing costs is the title bill. The title bill will include anything from the title search fees to collection of taxes that are due within 60 days of the closing, any sort of violations or liens that have to be cleared before the closing, and any escrow or pickup fees that need to be paid at the closing. So a majority of your costs um, outside of your lender's costs is actually going to your title bill. They will also provide you with an itemized bill to show you what these fees are for and what they're collecting for. Some out-of-pocket fees would include your attorney's fees, which for Pardalis and Novik are always flat with no surprises. It will include any sort of co-op or condo fees, if that's the type of property you're purchasing, generally a move-in fee, um, next month's common charges or maintenance, maybe an attorney's fee on that end. You'll also have a title closer fee if you're purchasing real property and other various fees that might come up from the process of this contract in between you and the seller.